the way to establish trust for you in your husband is for him to become trustworthy, which he isn't yet. Um, and so you're, you don't trust him out of good judgment at this point. You don't trust him at this point because you're mapping what's real and as hard and as sobering as that is, because it's not the picture you want. The fact that you're willing to stay awake to it is really important for you becoming more solid, knowing what's up and what's down, and being able to even track if he becomes a trustworthy person or not. Right? You have to trust your own radar to be able to trust what you map about him because if your need, and this may not be true for you, but it's often true for people in marriages, they need so much to see their spouse as trustworthy that they corrupt their own ability to map reality because they don't want to deal with what they feel and see. And that's dangerous in relationships. If you need too much for your spouse to be what you want them to be, you're going to be less able to deal with what is real and therefore always insecure and reinforcing dependency on someone who is not dependable. 